If you're looking to get a laptop for programming and don't know where to start, we can help you with that. But first, let's go through what we're looking for in a coding laptop. Preferably, you'd want a good amount of RAM 16 GB to start and a competent CPU that'll allow you to compile and test your code faster to help you find the perfect model We've compiled a list of the five best laptops for programming. Be sure to check link in the description below for prices and additional details. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the bell icon for the latest tech updates. Now, without further ado, let's dive in. Number 5. Microsoft Surface Pro 8. The best 2-in-1 tablet we've tested is... The Microsoft Surface Pro 8 2024, a tablet Windows PC with a built-in kickstand and detachable keyboard. With this versatile form factor, you can detach the keyboard to make the device lighter and easier to hold or to save space, like on a kitchen counter or airplane tray table. Its 3.2 display looks incredibly sharp and gets bright enough for outdoor use. Plus, it has a 120 Hz refresh rate, which makes the system feel more responsive, especially when using pen input. Unfortunately, you must buy the stylus separately. The same goes for the keyboard. The stylus is optional, but the keyboard is a near necessity because Windows isn't particularly touch-friendly, and the keyboard also helps protect the screen from scratches. The webcam is excellent and among the best on the market, and you also get an IR camera for quick logins. Via facial recognition, battery life is passable at around 7 hours of light use or 6 hours of video playback. One thing to note is that Microsoft has already released the Surface Pro 9. It's identical to the Pro 8 in design. It just has a faster Intel 12th Gen processor. The performance increase likely isn't noticeable in light productivity workloads, so you aren't missing out on much. Number 4. HP Spectre X360 14. If you don't need the processing power of a workstation like the Apple MacBook Pro 14 M3 2024 and prefer something more portable, check out the HP Spectre X360 14 2024. This ultra portable feels very well built and provides a greater user experience with its 120 Hz 2.8K OLED display, spacious keyboard, and large haptic touchpad. It also has an excellent 4K webcam, Wi-Fi 7, and a decent port selection that includes two USB-C Thunderbolt 4s, plus, since this is a 2-in-1 convertible, you can flip the screen around and use it as a tablet. The display supports pen input if you want to take handwritten notes, though you may have to buy the pen separately. Depending on the retailer, you can configure it with an Intel Core Ultra 5 or Ultra 7 CPU. Both perform well with minimal throttling under load. Battery life is excellent at around 11 hours of light use. You can get this laptop from HP if you have trouble finding it elsewhere. The Apple MacBook Air 15 2024 is also a great option. If you prefer Mac OS, it's very portable for a 15-inch model, and its battery lasts easily through a full workday. It has a sharp 60 Hz retina display, not as pretty as the Spectre's OLED panel but brighter, and a comfortable, spacious keyboard. You also get a large haptic touchpad, one of the best speaker systems on the market, and an excellent 1080p webcam for video calls. Apple's M3 SoC is fast enough for most programmers, and you won't have to deal with fan noise since this is a fanless device. The main drawback is its limited port selection, as it's still limited to two USB-C Thunderbolt 3 ports. Unlike its M2 predecessor, the M3 model can output to two external displays, but that only works with the laptop closed. Number 3. Dell Inspiron 16. 2-in-1. The best laptop for developers we've tested in. The mid-range tier is the Dell Inspiron 16 2-in-1 2024. It sports a large 16-inch display, so you get plenty of room to see your codes. And since it's a 2-in-1, you can flip the screen around and use it as a tablet, sporting a full aluminum chassis. It feels surprisingly well-built for a laptop in its class. And it isn't overly bulky for a 16-inch model. 
making it easy to carry around. The battery lasts around 10 hours of light use and charges over USB-C. You can get this laptop with an AMD Ryzen 5 7530OU or Ryzen 7 7730OU CPU. Both perform well and are suitable for programming. We recommend getting a model with 16GB of RAM. Since the memory isn't user upgradable, the keyboard feels a little mushy but is still comfortable to type on for extended periods, and the touchpad is large and responsive. The port selection is excellent, though there's no Thunderbolt 4 support since it's an AMD system. It sports a large 16-inch display, so you get plenty of room to see your codes, and since it's a 2-in-1, you can flip the screen around and use it as a tablet, sporting a full aluminum chassis. It feels surprisingly well-built for a laptop in its class, and it isn't overly bulky for a 16-inch model, making it easy to carry around. Number 2. Asus VivoBook 16 M1605, our best budget pick, is the Asus VivoBook 16 M1605 2024, like the Dell Inspiron 16 2-in-1 2024. Above, this is a 16-inch model, but it isn't a 2-in-1, so you lose the tablet functionality. You still get a nice keyboard, a large touchpad, and decent performance from its AMD Ryzen CPU. Its fingerprint sensor allows you to log in quickly, and its battery lasts around 8 hours of light use. Build quality is good, though not quite as sturdy as the Dell, as it's mostly plastic. Unfortunately, there are a couple of compromises. First, the display only gets to about 250 CDEM Tau at full brightness which is fine for most indoor settings, but not for sunny, environments, or outdoors in broad daylight. Next, unlike the Dell, there's only one USB-C port, and it doesn't support video output, meaning you can only use the HDMI port to connect to an external monitor. Last, the webcam is noticeably worse, as the image looks much softer and overexposed, and its battery lasts around 8 hours of light use. Build quality is good, though not quite as sturdy as the Dell, as it's mostly plastic first. The display only gets to about 250 CDM Meto at full brightness, which is fine for most indoor settings, but not for sunny environments or outdoors in broad daylight. Number 1. Apple MacBook Pro 14. The best laptop for programming we've tested is the Apple MacBook Pro 14 M3 2024. This premium workstation has a sturdy all-aluminum build, a compact design, and all-day battery life. You can get this model with a base M3, M3 Pro, or M3 Max SoC, so you can choose, depending on your budget and how demanding your workload is. The Pro and Max chips have a very capable GPU, which is great for game development or anyone requiring high graphical horsepower. The downside is that you'll pay for the GPU performance even if you don't need it. In addition to its amazing performance, this laptop provides a great user experience with its sharp mini-LED display, spacious keyboard, and gigantic, easy-to-use haptic touchpad. Its port selection is excellent, allowing you to connect peripherals and external displays easily. If you prefer more screen space over portability, get the Apple MacBook Pro 16. M3 2024. Instead, it's essentially the same device, just bigger and with better sounding speakers. The only difference is that the base M3 chip isn't available on the 16 inch. Also, it's more expensive. Our recommendation for Windows users is the Dell XPS 16 2024. Also a premium workstation, the 16 inch model is a new addition to Dell's XPS lineup, replacing the older 17 inch model.